Hi guys, Olga Sobi here and today I'm going to do acrylic pour with an orange juicer. I'm pretty excited to see what I can get out of it and it's pretty crazy how many different supplies can be used for pouring. All right, so <clears throat> I want to uh, pour through the orange juicer, but I don't want it to touch the surface because the one I have is very flat right here. And I think if I put it right on the surface, it's gonna be all muddy. So I want to place it above the canvas, but I know I would not be able to hold it steady for the entire process. So I came up <laughs> with a very complicated system here so i'm going to hold it like this i'm going to use one hand to hold it this way so it stays in place pretty much in place and i think that should work just fine so i'm gonna get right to the business all of my colors are mixed with fluoritrol today now oh, this looks so pretty My color combination today is inspired by the mandarin duck. Have you seen those birds? They're just gorgeous. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to like the outcome, but just watching this is super satisfying so i'm already happy that i'm doing it I think I'm ready to stop. Now the question is, how am I going to remove it? One quick move, probably. Okay, not too bad. This is kind of cool. This is very much like uh, reverse colander pour that I did. Huh, I like it. Like the drips are forming such beautiful shapes. I feel like I don't want to tilt it, but I'm gonna grab my Lazy Susan and I'm going to use it to spin this paint. If you guys wanna see how I did my Lazy Susan, I have a video about it, I'm going to link it in the description. Well, I think that this is pretty cool. The result is very close to what I had with the um, reverse colander, like it also created the shape of the flower, but the center definitely looks different. I would love to hear from you what you think about this orange juicer pour. By the way, it looks just beautiful. I really like how it looks. Um, if you're also gonna give it a try, I would love to see your results in our Facebook group. I'm also gonna link it in the description. And thank you so much for watching. If you want to see more videos, please subscribe to my channel and turn that notification on so you're always notified when I'm posting new videos. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.